<sighs> Great day, Brother Kwame. Oh. Let's scoop this back just a little bit. See, I get a little bit more. Let me post up some stuff real quick. Turning down my volume, of course. I'm learning my lessons. Uh. Good near, great near to you, my my brother. What's going on? Let me find. There I go. All right. You post a comment up, and we get started. Let me. One. I'm almost done. Now we get started. Can you hear me out there? Alright, so now we get started. Alright, cool. Alright, so here we go, man. I am struggling. I am um, my, my vision is blurry. I don't know what's going on. I really don't know what's going on. Great morning, great near, Miss Sheila. I don't know what's going on because, uh, I, you know, I didn't, I didn't know accidents did you like this. My vision blurry. I mean, I knew I already wear glasses, but I'm. It's hard for me to read stuff on the computer screen when I've been doing this for a while without glasses. I'm sitting up like, ah, uh. but hey, it's time for us to get started. So let's go and drink the water. All right, so today on the show, we're going to be talking about endurance. Endurance. And how our ancestors through folk tales and um, proverbs have basically prepared us for victory. But, and there's a big but there, something we got to do. So, drink your water. Great morning. Great near. Every I'm not. I'm not really. But I bought. A, I bought a bunch of these. So I'm out. I'm not really. That one I had on. Uh, the one I had on uh, Kooji Chagalia, the 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 black volcanic one, that that shit was a die for. Her. But this right here, I'm not really. I mean, I taste the minerals and stuff. I'm not. Yeah. All right. Sixteen ounces gone. Family gonna drink it up. A lot of that. I uh, say the flow. Um, hopefully, I have some bitters tomorrow. Um, I'm also gonna work on bottling up some stuff today. Gonna be uh, chilling for a couple of days. Um, so 
I'm going to try to keep, you know, except for on those weekends. Um, Kumba and Money, y'all know y'all got to catch me when, when y'all catch me. But as of, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to be trying to keep the times around the same time. But I'm going to be off for a little while. I need to heal. I guess the taste can grow on you. I don't know. What type of water is y'all drinking out there? Family, I made it to day five. And it's not even the hunger that's bothering me. It's, uh, it's not the, it's not even the hunger, man. So we're gonna do our toast. Oh, my fault. Bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out, bring them out. I only got one bottle up here this morning. So, but I got a whole bunch of bottles because I'm about to, we about to start bottling. Bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out, bring them out. Bring them out, bring them out. So, we got a lot of bottles over here. And we about to do it. Congratulations on what? Because bottling is the most unglamorous part of this job. Big bottles, love it. Small bottles, small bottles. Too much going on. All right. I want to welcome everybody that's here now and um, that may be here in the future. You know what I'm saying? So I want to thank each and every last one of you for taking the time. Oh, day five. Yeah. Oh, no, no. Congratulate me yet. Um, 21 minus five is 16. <laughs> 16 left. So we're going to. We're going to push it. We're going to push it. And this weekend, the juice part ends. Even though I ain't been drinking a lot of juice. I did. I had me a, a espresso yesterday. And uh, that was it was pretty smooth. But uh, pretty much that's it. So next week, we're going to be moving to just the water. And that ambrosia, right? So, hmm, trying to call the energy down. Y'all see I'm as hyped as I usually am. I'm just waiting for the high to come in, but it's like I got a fog. I mean, it's sort of like, a, it's sort of like walking in the early morning mist. Where you can see almost everything, but you can't. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It's, it interferes. It's not clear, and I, and you know, like I said, and um, I didn't start feeling like this till accident. I done fasted at least five days before, and, and never felt like this. My whole body is sore, um, so it's kind of. You know, that's why that's why I'm doing the thing on Endure right now because it's like, it's like 
whenever you try to make changes in your life, it's always something or someone that jumps in and begins to try to interfere with, with your process. And you you just basically have to endure. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's just because it's, it's a simple test. Um Oftentimes, you know, if you look, if you look in the fables, man, the, the fables, the myths, there's always some type of trickster that tries to hold you in the position that you're in, the test to see if that's what you, if you really, really, really want to make the change, if you really, really, really want the reward, you always have something that's trying to test you, and basically, that's what this is, a test, endure, so, we lift up our glass to the creator by whatever name you choose to call it creator. We call on that great force, that great power. We call it into our lives even though we know it's all around us. We just call it to activate so um, we can start noticing it everywhere. So we lift up our glasses and we thank that creator. And we say, I say. From there, we move on to um, our personal ancestors. We call on our personal ancestors. We call on... Uh, our mothers and our fathers, our, our uncles and our aunts, uh, our, our friends and our cousins, our nieces and our nephews. We call on all those that made their transition and we lift them up, right? We remember them. We 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 praise them. You know what I'm saying? We we thank them for their interaction and, and, and we, we thank them for helping us become who we are today. We toast those ancestors. Um... Miles Brown, Mizan, Robin the Texan, and Davis and Brown, Sean Rosalie, Tilly, Jojo, William Walton, Chris, and Fanny Gadsden, Alina, Uncle Chris, Geneva Brown, Cleveland Brown, Margaret Ellis, Cecil Ellis, um, Alvaro Brown, Gina Gaines, Herman Brown Jr., Wash Ellis, Wash Ellis Jr., um, I say Herman Herman Brown Jr. Um, so uh, so pet my ride. No more X. We call on um, uh, Montague Pimentel, Jamon Jones, John Fillard, Jeremiah Tappan, Elder Donaldson, Elder Hairston, Elder Farmer, um, Dr. Marianne Williams, Tony Clark, Yusuf Pastor Yusuf Weston. Um, any others? Any others? All right, so we toast and we say, I say, right? From there, we move to this moment, which is, which is one of my favorite principles of the year, which brings us back to the pineal gland, which helps an individual identify. Identify their purpose. Now, a lot of people start talking about whether it's the count, what do they call it, the crown chakra, they call it the, the first eye. I'm pointing at the center of my head, in, right in between uh, my my eyes, right for the pineal gland. So, the, the 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 thing about the pineal gland is that once we start clearing it out, people be expecting grandiose visions and we and, and and we have to understand that um our ancestors and even in the creator in most cases don't work in grandiose fashion i mean so i mean tv has geared us up so that we miss a lot of our blessings we miss a lot of our powers we miss a lot of our opportunities because when it happens the sky is supposed to part Angels are supposed to sing, and a deep voice is supposed to speak to you, sounding like James Earl Jones telling you the truth. You know what I'm saying? When in fact, the message may be as simple as a bird flying by you, and it's uh, such a rare bird that it catches your attention, or the numbers on a, a, a house that you need to go visit might be delivering a message to It's like you become more perceptive. Right, you get into rhythm. Right now, we're out of rhythm. So, I'm just saying, 
when we start doing the work that we're doing and, and we start toasting the ancestors, don't be looking for nothing grand. Just be just be perceptive, be open, be conscious, be aware um, of of events, of even everyday events. Right. Um, because our ancestors, you know, I mean, it's very rare that you're going to walk on water. You see somebody walk on water or see somebody float and fly. And, you know what I'm saying? No, family don't happen like that. We got to be a little bit more grounded in what we're looking for. And we got to be a little bit more perceptive so that we could pull the lesson out of every step. Many of us be missing the lessons that have been handed to. I mean, we have wisdom being given to us, but many of us are looking for this grandiose stuff and we miss a major part of our blessings. We miss a major part of our um, of our learning because we are caught up in what TV has taught us, like what they teach us about ancestors. Although a lot of us don't think they're teaching us about ancestors, they are teaching us about ancestors, right? Because all these zombie movies, all these monster movies, right, are talking about something deep and, and, and something we don't understand, which is indirectly a shot at us and our relationship with our ancestors. Hell, the whole zombie piece come out of individuals who had uh, a deep spiritual science with us, right? There wouldn't be no zombies if there wasn't no Haiti, right? Hmm? The whole idea, right? So we gotta be we gotta be careful about what we expect and, and, and even even what we allow into the mind computer. You know what I'm saying? Because it starts processing shit. And I'm telling you right now, the warfare that's being waged on us, man, they so slick with it. Shit. They slick with it. I mean, I was just sitting around. I, I, I mean, I'm, I, I, I go to stores. I, I mean, they slick with this shit. And I'm like, I can't even be mad at them. So we raise our glass to the on this to this day of need because this is the day of purpose, right? And um, we want to salute it, and we want to be looking for purpose in everything that we do today, right? We want to know that. Um, our power is in this moment. And by us embracing the life-giving principle of Nia, we live. We learn to live the, the best life. That's what my ancestors say. The best life is achieved by engagement with systematic processes. All right. So we toast this moment. We move on. We toast our children, our children's children, on to infinity. Um, we are responsible for our children. We are responsible um for what they learn, we're responsible for the examples that we set. So we toast them and we say, I say, last but not least, I toast you. We lift up the glass for any special, um, any special events or any special things that you need to happen in your life. We ask for the ancestors to move in your life. We ask for them to bless you. And with that, we say, Shay, I say, I wish you peace, power, joy, and 100 years. Man, all right. Oh, today I'm drinking my experiment: the turmeric, cinnamon, and ginger. Mmm. So, um, that's it for the day, family. So I will. Um, I know I see you. I see you dropping in and out, and I think um, I think Kwame is dropping in and out too. But you know, when I first turned it on this morning, it said something about. That I could not broadcast. So it's not just your signal. Um, and uh, the piece that we got to understand is that, you know, Facebook is not ours. You know, um, as, as brilliant as it is, 
is not ours. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to migrate eventually to some other platforms so that we can make sure that what we doing is being um done right. Right? You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, you know, sometimes this won't even pop up on my timeline. You know what I'm saying? Stuff that y'all doing won't even pop up on my timeline. You know what I'm saying? They got logarithms to decide what you want and what you need to look at, you know. So, we got to get our kids into understanding logarithms and stuff like that so that we can start shaping and forming our stuff. But it ain't just you. I think it's a lot of people with bad connections. I'm seeing a couple of people come in and fall off. So, but yo, family, I want to thank you. And we are out. Peace. See you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.